right, so, so my YouTubers out there, I, I have to just make this quick video. You know, I'm always on the road. But I have to make this quick video because I swear to God, black people are the dumbest set of people on the planet. And yes, I'm black, but I have to call a spade a spade. Black people continue, like, I, I, so I heard Ricky Smiley, this walking bozo is going to sit down and try to shame black men because black men have a lot of questions. They don't feel comfortable voting for Kamala Harris. And he is going to try to shame black people into voting for her. And he never talks about policies. He talks about she's an alpha, beta, kappa. I, I don't give a fuck what the hell she is. And, she, and they also talk about um, she's going to be inaugurated um, by a black woman on MLK. Isn't that so historic? No, it's not. Because Kamala Harris have been the vice president going on for four years. They did nothing but ruin the economy, made our lives even worse. And then you turn around and then you say, oh, well, she's going to fix it. And Kamala Harris is saying on day one. And she's already stolen a couple of ideas from Trump, which, tells, which should tell you a lot. No originality, no creativity, nothing. And, and these black women are sitting up here talking about, I'm, I'm for her. And they say black women are the smartest. No, they're not the smartest. They're the most indoctrinated. I agree with the, um, what's his name, from a black conservative, conservative perspective. They're the most indoctrinated. They'll, because black people, like I said, we will fall for anything. And because black women are the breadwinners and black men are one of the most poorest in America, thanks to Democrats. This has nothing to do with Republicans. I, Democrats know how to pull this line. Democrats' policies have made black women the breadwinner and black men the, one of the poorest in America. And it was designed that way when they broke the, the, the black family up. It was designed that way. But, um, now Kamala Harris is hiding. She's in a, in a basement somewhere. She's not doing no interviews. Not doing no press conference. You know? And Trump is. And the only thing that they can say is Trump's a racist. Trump's a dick. Wants to be a dictator. These are all talking points. And when you hear black people repeating the same goddamn thing without doing their own research, it's sickening. And Ricky Smiley going to talk about do your research. Kamala Harris done so much for the black community. But he couldn't say it because she has none. She, she has none. Kamala Harris has done nothing for the black community. Kamala Harris has done nothing, period. And you're the, you're the vice president right now, probably acting president, who knows. And you're telling me that like no taps on tax on tips. You can have done this already? You're going to wait till you become president to say you're going to do this, which we know you're not because you're the one that voted uh, voted for the um, the Inflation Reduction Act, which actually did more harm than good and raised taxes on tips. You signed it. You were the deciding factor and you signed it into law and it just made things worse. And now you steal a, a something from Trump and you say, well, this... I'm going to do it day one. Do it now. Do it right now. You're the president. You're the vice president. And probably acting president. So do it right now. Go in and make these changes to show that, hey, this is what I did. But you can't. Because you're nothing but a puppet. You can't You can't talk about any policies because you have none. And you're not good at, 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 at explaining yourself. So it kills me. I swear black people are dumb and stupid. We we are the dumb. You go ahead and listen to this stupid Steve Harvey and Ricky Smiley, all these dumb idiots. And people like Roland Martin, who like to who like to interview people like Richard Spencer. Who, who Richard Spencer was 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 a Democrat before becoming the alt-right leader, which is now back to a Democrat. 
and alt-right uh, movement is nowhere to be found. They don't even exist anymore. And fucking Roland Martin holding an interview. When he was, when I knew he was a Democrat before he became alt-right, and I see, um, 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 what you call it, holding an interview. You need to watch this interview. It was the most dumbest interview I ever seen in my life. Roland Martin is a clown. It's a sideshow, and all he's doing is getting paid to make you black people look dumb and stupid. And so that's why I say, us black people, we are dumb. We are just straight up dumb. And all we do is we vote for the same bullshit, and then we get up after it's voted and nothing happens. Like Obama, for eight years, we dance in the street for Obama, twerking, all kind of dumb shit. Obama does nothing, and what do we do? We cry. And then vote back the same people. That's why they don't do anything for us. Because they know we're so stupid that we're going to vote for them. So, I had to get that off my chest. Because you damn black people will be pissing me off. But, um, I'll be back again with another video. Because I just have to vent. Because we really cannot have Kamala Harris in office. Because... If she was this good and she got these great ideas that's going to save the economy, they would have done it by now. So, once again, my name is Mark. And if you have any questions or you want to um, talk about anything or you would like for me to come on to one of your shows or something, please just um, leave me a message. I, I check my messages all the time. Um, so, just leave me a message at the bottom you know, in the comment section, and I'll be more than happy to respond. All right, peace.